You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures TV. Why would he hit your brother so much? Huh? He's not my brother. How can I call a blood sucking demon my brother? No! I can never regard him as my own brother. Now nice. stop making this claim, Biko. Stop it! Huh? You don't even have any strong evidence over what you accuse your own brother of. What strong evidence do you need? As soon as he became rich, my both parents died. You should have seen how he frustrated me with his wealth. At a point, I almost took my own life, even though God has saved me. For that reason, I will sever anything that binds us together as brothers. But I will never in, love him. Eh, but you are still living in his house. You are living in the house of a man you hate so much. Remember, he's going to bury his daughter here. What house are you talking about? The, the, the house he renovated belongs to my own father. This house was built by my father in his own land. Therefore, it's my father's house in my father's land. Yeah. Nine. Nine. I will suggest you make peace with your brother. So, from one new well. Okay, back on the other rose. On one rose, they know. Make peace with your brother. Open the way, hold your name. Tell him, talk to him one on one as your blood. Call God, that's why he will not stop that. You have this bitterness in you over him. That there's something he's doing that you're not, you are not, you are not happy with. Rather than hating him so much. See, I would suggest you make peace with your brother. Talk to him. Ask him. Uh, in fact, ask God to change him. Everything you just said, I have taken those measures. They didn't work. For that reason, I am severing any call that binds us as brother. Can't you understand what I'm telling you? You are your own, Unai. Yes, so I and my children will not do that because he has not done anything wrong to us. Oh, my major one. Okay, the other day, he gave us some tea money to pay her school fees and buy all the books she needed. Okay, look at Odenaka. Because Odenaka is not good with his school, he now took him with him to learn a line of trade. Then after that, he will give him capital to establish himself. And you are still bitter. Over all these things. Okay, look at me. See all the things he has been buying for me. See all what he has been doing for me. And you want me. Mbano, no man, he has been good to me. Okay. Since I remember, he has been good to me. It's alright. Ah. He has been good to you. Yes, sir. He has been good to you. Uh -huh. He has been good to your children. He has been buying this. He has been buying that. Now, woman, listen. I will not prevent you not to associate with him. But let me warn you. If anything eventually happens to my children, you will see the other side of me. Promise I'm I will not do that. Oh. You will see the other side. I will not do that. There we were. There we were. All the time. My brother. Hit there. Hit there. So you. Oh, it's very bad. It's very, very bad. Eh? It's very, very bad. Careful. So when you want to read a book, you go through the preface. The preface tells you almost the content of the book. So table of contents, dedication, acknowledgement. Author, preface, chapter one. Internet fundamentals, history of internet, services of the internet, connecting to the internet, world web, wide web, web browser, web page, hypertext, web address, searching on the web, blog, Facebook, and MySpace. You have Facebook now? Chapter 2, Website Design Package, Microsoft, Front Page, Micromedia, Dreamweaver, Hypertext, Markup, Language, Elements in HTML, Documents, Attributes, Syntax, 
HTML like JavaScript, writing JavaScript, running JavaScript, browser support, JavaScript not Java, advantages of JavaScript, disadvantages of JavaScript, rise and fall of dynamic HTML, JavaScript libraries, add JavaScript to your page, add event handles. Take so you read this one. Right. Plan your website. Mm -hmm. Why do you want a website? Mm -hmm. Who are your users? Right. Where will you set your content? Right. Where will your visual design look like? Mm -hmm. Organize your files. Right. Who, who is the development team? Management rules. Visual design rules. Good. Okay. Chapter nine. Adobe. Photoshop, right. Adobe Fireworks, mm -hmm. other options, mm -hmm. screen design, consideration. Hey! Hi! Uncle! Amanda, how are you? I'm fine! You okay? Yes, I'm good. I got you this. Wow! Oh. And um, is your sister home? Yes, she's home. But when she saw you, she hid herself and told me not to tell you. Oh. But because of this, I'll show you to where she hid herself. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's good. I'm sure you like it. Yes, I do. You know, apart from my parents and my siblings, right? no one has ever given me a gift. Oh, that means I'm the first. Yes, and you're a nice person. And I pray you get married to my sister. Oh, <laughs> thanks uh, for the compliments. And I say amen to that. But... Let the will of God be done. Of course, <laughs> it's real. <laughs> right. Um, so, can I see her now? Yes. Shh. Let's go. Um, I should come with you? Yes. such a lively girl. I wish you never left. You know I cared about you so much. I wish I could bring you back. I would fight with my last blood. I love you so much. Like this. Sometimes I wonder what drives you to some of the decisions you take. Amanda was not sick. A very strong girl. Hell and hearty. Came back from school. Went to her room and lay and gave up the ghost. And it never bothered you to ask yourself this question. What's happened to your daughter? What's happened to Amanda? Who killed her? Who masterminded her death? Whether it's a natural death or somebody has a hand in it, you never cared. Oh God. Has it occurred to you? That no matter the researches and discovery, none of these will bring back my daughter. What if the plan is close to this? What if he is masterminding another person's death? Who knows his next victim? My husband, why are you so careless with life? I have seen a lot in my life on earth. 
What if the kind of investigation keeps her unburied for months or even years? And to even think that all these will not bring back our daughter. It has made me to consider that the investigation, the researches, or whatever you call it, are just wasteful ventures. Wasteful ventures, of course. Come, if I die today, please bury me and let me go and rest. And if the death is not natural, then let the one who killed me and my God to settle their problems. Can you list it to yourself? Can you list it to yourself? Sometimes you sound so annoying. Why are you so annoying? But even if you don't care to find out what happened to Amanda, I promise you this. I must surely get to the root of this. I must surely find out who masterminded the death of my beloved daughter. Woman, do whatever you want to do. But please, I beg you with God. Allow me to bury my daughter this weekend. I can't afford to let her remain in the morgue. Please. Amanda, is that you? Mom! 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 Daughter, it's okay. There is no Amanda, okay? Yeah? I think uh, she's hallucinating. From now onwards, we will not allow her to stay alone. From those Every man was made, and to dust shall we all return. Our body must be planted like a seed in the soil. Today is our sister's turn. We all believe she is resting in the bosom of the Lord. Let us all amend our ways so that on that day we will all meet at the right side of the Lord to partner man and to marry forever with the angels. Amen. It is now time for the family members to say their farewell message before she's laid to rest. Please. <laughs> Give your 
villas. Hurt them. Wherever they are. Hurt them. Don't give them peace. Don't give them peace. Don't give them peace. Don't give them peace. Hurt them. Kill all of them. No matter who the person is. From my family, from your family, from your father's family. Freeze them out. Freeze them out. Kill all of them. Kill them. Finish them. Finish them. Kill them all. 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 So you're dead, you're beginning to the end. Whoever that has to act will kill them. Kill them out. Kill all of them. Watch them. Kill them. Oh. Oh. Kill them. 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 How long are we going to push you? No, 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 just tell me. Doesn't it bother you as brothers from the same room? Stop me, the sermon. I stopped being your brother when I started suspecting your source of income. But I remember we had some good times in those days. Nothing happened to you. Who told you nothing happens to me? Look, look, look. Don't force words out of my mouth. You've torn our parents' house to a better ground. Eh? I only allowed you because I am not the first son. I pray, so God will give me money, I will leave this house for you. Hey, look, how many people died? How many people look, died? I want to know how many people we have buried in this house. Our only sister died, I was buried here. That was when I had nothing. When I could barely feed. And you are saying this? Not up to one year, you made your magic money. Three months after, our both parents died. Hey, Luca, why are you blaming me for the deaths of our parents? It's only God that has the power to make us stay or come over to him. Hey, baby, listen, listen, God. I no longer see you as my own brother. And I want you to take it that way. You are no longer my brother. You are wicked, you are cruel, you are evil. I heard what you said to your brother. He was even trying to make peace. Manager, you kept condemning him. I don't get it. Does it mean I am not a child? And who are you to tell me what is right or wrong? Your wife. You are my wife and you are supposed to stand by my side and not to condemn me. I will only stand by you when you are right. Yes. I told you that man is a ritualist. And he said he's not. You believe him. So you now made me a liar. Not so. But the basis on which you condemn your brother is not strong enough for me to stand by you. That man is kind hearted. It's more mad Everybody loves him. And he loves everybody. So why will you condemn him? Please shut up. Who told you that man, that man is kind hearted? Because he gives you money. That made him kind hearted. I know women lost money. Yes. That is why you are telling me he's kind hearted. In the world of women, money means everything. Now listen, if anything happens to my children as a result of your insatiable crave for money, you will see the other side of me you never knew existed. Only the mama, see, calm down. Don't touch me. You need to understand something, eh? Nanya. I don't want to understand anything. Whatever it is you want to tell me, keep it to yourself. And don't you ever interrupt me. Do you hear me? Don't you ever interrupt me. 
Now I cool down now. Come on, no down. Eh? Wait to Obi, not for the cake. Hey, the man you called your brother. I heard the kind of rotten words that came out of his mouth before you. That man hates you. He hates you to the bone. No matter what, you see my brother. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised if you're saying this. You have been hypnotized. Oligogi. Okay, Furugi. Oligogi. A man that blames you for anybody that dies in this family. You still call him your brother. No matter what, he is my brother. I know deep down in his heart, he is planning on how to deal with you. He's planning to make you pay for everybody that died in this family. You are here calling him your brother. It's time you think. It's time you think and think fast. Remove yourself, detach yourself from anything that concerns him. Make as you can see, I am mourning. That's why we're in the village. You are mourning. And this is the right time for you to make right decision. Yes. Forget about him and anything that concerns him. Live your life. He hates you. I don't know. Leave one more. Let me know. Please. I've heard everything he said. He's still your brother. So Fungwan knew well. Biko, forgive him. You know, sometimes his words can be rotten. Not sometimes, all the time. Biko. All the time. Biko. 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 He's still your brother. Don't turn your back on us. You have been helpful to I and my children. They are your children too. And I'm sure if they become something in life, you'll be proud of them. If you turn your back on us, Biko. 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 Please. Biko. 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 Stand up. I don't have any problem with you. Neither do I have any problem with your children. Even your husband, I don't have any problem with him. It's just that ignorance is driving him against me. And I know, I know that someday, he will come to the realization that I'm the only brother that he has. So for one normal, only the mama, thank you. Biko, don't turn your back on us. Huh? Thank you very much. He's still your brother. That will name. Thank you. I'm a family rebel, your uncle, you see. I hope you are living well with your uncle and his family. Yes, mom. <coughs> My uncle has no problem. <coughs> Just his wife. I think she does not like me. And why would you say that? Mommy, everyone speaks so good about my auntie, how she treats them. But at home, she treats me so bad. She sees everything I do right wrong. I don't know what else to do to please her. Then you check, you make a check here. Check if there is something you are not doing right, then you adjust. Well, I've tried. I've done everything possible to make her to like me. But I don't think it's working out. She takes every slight opportunity to abuse me, to insult me, to embarrass me in the house. I don't know what else to do. I suspect she hates us because of the way our daddy talks to them. I wonder why our daddy wants us to stay away from the people that are willing to help us. It's something that's the same thing I'm saying. Father made us to hate them even before knowing them. Immediately I go to that house, everybody just love me. They treat me so nice apart from the wife. So me, I don't know, I don't actually know what was the problem. Odinaka. Mommy. Okay, mommy. Listen very well. All I need you to do is Pay attention to whatever your uncle and your auntie is saying. Don't listen to your daddy. Okay, Nani. I just pray that one day he will come to realize that that man is his only brother and come to love him. But the only thing I'm telling you now is always be attentive. Rubelu Fisi, all the very important. Do you hear me? Yes, ma. Okay, Nani. Yes, ma. That's the only thing I have to say. I will. Let me just see you. 
Blue said, I'm not running because I'm big. Come and sit down. Leave me. You don't still hold me. Leave me just. Since, since Amanda passed away, I haven't been myself. Come here, baby. I know, it's, it's so sad. You know, her death, her death hit all of us so bad. Yeah. I even heard they had a candlelight for her in her school. It's so sad. My poor sister. It's okay. I'll be fine. Let's go to bed. Go to bed? Yes. 